So, it's come to this. Welcome to what is hopefully the first of many episodes of The Broiled Nuts. So congratulations to Rusty and to B2 for coming up with that little name. See, my name's Sean Broyles. But when you put broiled with broils and nuts together, you make a... Anyway, the show is about this nutty family who many of you and my friends have said would make a an outstanding show, considering that they're all crazy. Nuts, see? Hence the point. It's me, my wife, three daughters, and uh, a dog and a cat. And now me, being home, so we're going to hopefully show you a bunch of funny things that, uh, that basically I go through every day as the uh, stay-at-home dad who's still trying to live his own life without going nuts. So, first episode. What happens here on a daily basis? I wake up, I come downstairs, and I see my daughter, Sydney. Is there a reason we're watching this Family Matters every day, or can we watch something else? Or... I watch it every day. What? I watch it every day. Mm. While she watches her shows, I do what, uh, what many red-blooded American males do. Usually spend about six, seven hours on Facebook um, when I'm not emailing my wife. But really, the day is about Sydney my four-year-old who is tremendously funny in her own way. The mailman spelled a yucky, had a yucky spell, and he, and he breaks up into different roses. What's going on with your hair? It gets messed up when I sleep. Oh. Mommy forgot to put it yesterday. My project of the day. Today's project was uh, installing the backup hard drive. I think the important thing about this video is what's playing in the background. Yeah, you're damn right. That's Billy Ocean. My wife gets on me for seeing as I'm here and I'm at home with the, with the children is that I don't know how to dress them very well. Do the shorts match. No, because I can't find any batches that go with this. But you just want to wear them? Yes. All right, go ahead. That's fine. But you know, it's not all fun. I mean, everybody gets home from school, and it's, you know, then it becomes really crazy, but we always try to sit home and have a good dinner. Um, and today, it was funny because um, Amaya, the eight-year-old, had an interesting wow. story of something that happened at school. I don't make this stuff up. Oh, wait a minute. It was on a whiteboard? Or a he drew it on a whiteboard. On a whiteboard, we had all our own little individual. So we oh, on his little, whiteboard, yes. you do like little. He just drew the. He, he just drew the. He drew the butt. And then he drew the. The boy part. Yes. <laughs> well, that's not good. Oh. That's right. A kid drew a butt with a penis. A penis. My daughter saw the penis, and you know she's eight. We try to avoid having her see the penis until at least, uh, you know, 2021, maybe. And even then, we hope it's a bris. Uh, so anyway, yeah, that's, the, uh, that's about it here. So hopefully we'll be keeping this up. We've got confessionals that you can go see. Uh, with, you know, Amaya will talk more about the butt penis incident. And, uh, and Sydney, you can hear her talk more about, uh, about who she is as a person. Hopefully we can get Megan in this it's a couple of times a, uh, a year. That's it. Hopefully you enjoyed it and, uh, and hope to see you tomorrow. We'll have to do this every day back here on the Broiled Nuts. We'll see you later.